place never to see you again that was simply delusion followed up with confusion that was just substitution for a lonely bed so that's impressive how much you're messing with my feelings and my heart That I was out of my mind Thinking you were the one That it was love Feelings were strong I should have known I should know I don't know what I was thinking Let it be more than drinking And going back to your place Never to see you So I'm running late I am actually going to meet my sister For dinner And I'm running late so I wanted to quickly show you, this is my outfit of the night. I'm going to pull up one of my jackets. Don't mind the mess that's in the wardrobe over there. But uh, yeah, that's the outfit of the night. Let's go. I'm running late. So I decided to pair it with this Vera Moda sort of like blazer. Um, I think it's a nice look, especially considering that it's Tuesday. And it gives off that whole vibe that I'm coming from work and going to dinner. So really, really like it. Uh, boots are Aldo, dress is River Island, and top is, like I said, Vera Moda. All right, let me be on my way. Your friends are gonna... Hi, everyone. I'm with your fave, and we're on our way to uh, Short Market Club. Yeah, Short Market Club. In Short Rose Market Bank. Club in Rosebank. We're going for dinner. She went there last week with some friends, and now she wants everybody in her to life go. to go. Yeah. So I'm everybody in her life because I don't our know parents that many people. <laughs> because our parents packed up on us. So imagine. Is it deposit? Is it deposit? And then they don't come. So. So the lighting, my goodness, look at your ultimate fave. But you guys need to cool a mara kya fall. It's a little bit different. Yeah. So we're on our way. It's, it's I'm so excited. Did you get tested for COVID? Yes, I'm fine. I'm fine. Um, Did you get tested for HIV? <laughs> I haven't. I did. I haven't in a while though. I did. I know I did because I care about my health. Okay. Last time I tested, uh, last time I tested for HIV was like last year. Last time I tested, ah, yeah, but it makes sense. Like, yeah, I've been, been the same partner. I've been with one lover unless he he done changed up on me. The last time I tested for HIV was last week. Wow, easy, ne? <laughs> That's just because I need to make sure my boyfriend isn't busy. Right. Oh, right. I'm shaking, guys. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. So anyway, let you guys know when we get there. Okay, love ya. We're here. My sister's getting out the car. Uh, really excited. Looks like it's gonna be a good time. My sister and I are vibing in the car, man. We were having a conversation. We're just having a good time. Don't drop that thing. Hold on. See, never want to us. Began. Began. I'm just gonna have a double gin and tonic while you yeah. have an old fashioned, then we can pick our red or white. Japanese Terence bread, like what the hell? Out of the bread is better than all her problems. <laughs>
just finished with dinner and we are my sister is busy yeah but we are on our way home i will probably text you guys text you guys i will probably talk to you guys when i get home okay okay and hi uh it's a different day following day to um the dinner with my sister i am using my phone because i've just gotten to this portion of the vlog is the landlord diaries chair yeah. i've just gotten to uh my unit and they've been painting and working over the past day or so so i'm gonna go in there and have a look now they should be done tomorrow hopefully if everything goes well they should be done tomorrow um i'm very tired i've been running around all day with the plumber and the painter and builder's warehouse chair i am exhausted so we're gonna go inside i'm gonna put my mask on because there are people working and then i'll take little clips of how it looks now uh really really excited to actually see how much they've actually done so let's go in there Um, so it is about way later basically it's around 4 10 so it's 4 in the afternoon I'm meeting with my friends at 5 um, at Truffles on the Park in Santon and we're meeting for a drink and uh, early dinner kind of situation we're celebrating Prudence's birthday which is tomorrow but because she's got plans tomorrow we're meeting her today um, so yes, I'm in all black as I always am. What's new? <laughs> uh, I'm gonna vlog on my phone because I really don't feel like carrying my camera. I haven't seen my friends in a very long time and I really just want to hang out with them. I really haven't seen them in months. So uh, just wanted to pop in here and let you know that I'm actually on my way out. I have to close up the blinds because chances are uh, I'm gonna be back quite late. But I will vlog on my phone because you know that's how I do. That's who I is. That's what I'm about. I wanted to show you so many things earlier on today, but I couldn't because I got lazy and I had a couple of things that I needed to do in the morning. But I'll show you tomorrow. Tomorrow's also another day, and then I have to cut the vlog because I have to start editing it so I can drop it sometime next week. So today is Saturday, mind you. It's Saturday the 28th of um, May, and Prudence's birthday is tomorrow on the 29th. So let's head on out to Santa.
Hi everybody. Um, so it is a week later. I'm about to have a snack. I had a green smoothie earlier on. I don't know if I'd call this a snack more than I would call it a sugar injection. Um, mm. Um, hey everybody, it's about a week later. It's not a week, it's uh, three days later from the footage that you saw um, on Saturday when I was out or heading out to go out with my friends. Um, I really didn't film much on that day because it was the first time that I had seen my friends ever since coming back home. Uh, it had been months, even before um going away i hadn't seen my friends in a while so it was the first time having seen them and you know we were reconnecting we were laughing we were having a good time we were just vibing out you know what i'm saying so we just wanted some time to talk chat have a good time um not only that we were um celebrating <clears throat> We were celebrating Prudence's birthday. Um, so Saturday was the 28th. Prudence's birthday is the 29th. So because she was going to be busy on her birthday, we opted to all link up the night before. And we went to Truffles on the Park. Uh, if you follow me on Instagram, which you should, uh, if you follow me on Instagram, you'll see snippets of when I'm out and about and all that kind of stuff in a little bit more detail than you typically would on the vlog sometimes. Um, so ever since then, you know, the, life has happened. You know what I'm saying? Uh, went to work. I've been reading. Um, about 80% I'm listening to the... I'm listening and reading along to the audiobook for Luster by Raven Leilani. And wow, uh, talk about a very, very, ow, my nail is lifting. So I need to go get my nails done within the next day or two. Um, so talk about a brilliant book. I really think this book is fantastic. It's dark. It's got moments where it's just, what? You're reading this and you're like, man, what would I do in this kind of situation? Um, so you're following Edie, who's the main character, who I'm assuming that's Edie. That's Edie. Her lips, her everything. It's just gorgeous, gorgeous. Um, so you're following Edie and you're following just essentially her life. And she's a 20-something-year-old who is just really going through it you know what i'm saying she lives in new york and she lives with a roommate in you know in an, an apartment the size of a matchbox really with cockroaches and all of that uh she's barely making it alive barely making a decent salary and uh she's just you know you can't help but feel sorry for her she's just living her life but really recklessly and she doesn't really necessarily care um, she pretty much sleeps with everybody in her office and, uh, in this time she meets with, um, Eric and Eric is a married man and, uh, they meet online and they start talking and they start, you know, divulging secrets to one another and all of this, but of course, along the attraction that they have for one another and, um, they meet for the first time you read about it when they meet for the first time and it's rather awkward you know it's not the same as typically when they speak to each other over you know a, 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 a computer screen or a phone screen whatever um when they're in front of each other it's a little bit awkward for her and he takes her sort of to a theme park which in and of itself is just weird uh, in that time, he talks to her about how he is in an open marriage and uh, all this stuff, right? So at some point, they land up at Eric's house and sex happens uh, in Eric's wife's bed, in Eric's matrimonial bed. And um, it, it just things just get really, really wild. 
Uh, fast forward, you know, things happen. The wife eventually finds out about, well, she knows that Edie is in the picture. Of course, they've got an open marriage, but uh, she eventually sees Edie because Edie randomly rocks up at their house one day. And uh, Eric is not home, but the wife is. And um, suddenly Edie gets this mysterious text the following day saying, it was nice to meet you. We should do it again sometime soon. And I'm just like, which one is this one, you know? Uh, then, yeah, Edie loses her job. She ends up living with them for some time. And it's weird. It's basically weird, but it's raw. It's bold. Um, and for Raven Leilani, it's a de debut novel. Novel. It's a debut novel. And uh, I think it's fantastically written. I think it's really, really... You know, the difference with Ocean Vong's book is that it's very flowery and it's very fluffy, poetic, uh, whereas this one is just written impeccably. It's just... Wow! It's smart. It's... Um, it's on the nose, man. It's very, you know, there's parts, there's, there's a lot of sarcasm in there. There's talks about racism, uh, of course, open marriages, open relationships, that kind of thing. Um, you know, um, what's her name? Rachel. What's the wife's name? Rachel. It's not Rachel. It's, um, Rebecca. Uh, Rebecca and Eric have a black daughter and they are white. So you can imagine again, you know, because Edie is black, there's certain things that she notices in the time that she's staying with them. Um, you know, it's just, it's brilliant. I feel like it's brilliant. Do I feel sorry for Edie? Absolutely. Do I feel like, girl, you should want, you should want better for yourself. But Edie herself comes from a very, very traumatic and tragic uh, childhood and upbringing uh, with her mother who was, you know, a drug addict and a seller and a user and uh, her father who just really was in and out of her life. And uh, so she's also got her own baggage, you know what I'm saying? And I feel like there's parts of her that use se uses sex to kind of, numb the pain hence why she has all these ridiculous sexual interactions with the people at her work and random people that she meets out and about and all of that um, so it's about six days away from my birthday now really really excited about that i was actually drawing up a whole entire birthday list uh wish list of what i'd like for my birthday which i'm going to disseminate out to my friends and my family because they must be doing the right thing. Um, not only that, I'm going to be going away. Today is Tuesday. Today is, when, today is Wednesday, the 1st <laughs> of June. Uh, my birthday is next week on the 7th. Um, and um, that weekend, the, the 10th, I'll be going away with my partner for the weekend. So... That's going to be nice. That's going to be on the membership space. So if you are part of the members, you will be able to see a vlog. I might also include a, maybe a simple, basic, maybe shorter vlog on the main channel. But most of the, the wonderfulness that you're going to see from that vlog will be on the membership space. So if you are not... Uh, a member if you haven't joined the space with cat i really do suggest that you do and if you do not know how to join all you need to do is preferably do it from a laptop or a pc uh, some people with samsung or android phones do say that they can see the join button but myself with an apple phone i do not see the join button when i'm using my phone so i highly suggest that you use a laptop or a pc when you want to join the membership and on my my channel page my main channel page on the right hand side you will see the join button or below any one of my videos you will see the join button and you join and you follow the prompts and that's pretty much it it's about 40 bucks a month and there will be a video in the membership space every single week so basically there'll be two videos on the main space where everybody can see uh, and there'll be one video in the membership space. So there'll be three videos from me each week. Who do I think I am? I really don't know. That's it. Before I close out the vlog, I did say 
in my last vlog or my last video, the Q&A video, that I color now. So ever since I was gone, ever since I was away, something that I did quite a lot while I was there, um, and I did it quite a lot with my roommate, Angie, was that uh, I colored a lot. And I can't find the book that I used. I can't find uh, the other book that I used to color, but I did find this. So the first thing that I colored while I was away was this. And I cannot tell you, as basic as this looks, it was so relaxing to do. And I absolutely loved it so much that the first thing that I wanted to do when I came out of there was get a coloring book and coloring books and coloring pencils. Again, that's also on my wish list for my birthday. More coloring books, more coloring pencils. And uh, when I did come out, my partner bought me uh, this coloring book here, which is written Faith, Hope, and Love. And I and we got this from we got this from Exclusive Books. And we were going to go watch Doctor Strange that day. And we went and we picked it up. So I've started coloring in there. I don't know if you guys can see this. Yeah, I started coloring in the book. And um, it's lovely. I'm going to color a little bit now. Um, got some coloring pencils. I can't find my main coloring case with all my coloring pencils and all of that. I can't find it, so that's fine. Um, so yeah, most of the content that is in this vlog was filmed from my phone. Apologies for that because I did go out quite a bit and I do not like carrying my camera while I'm out and about. Um, to the work that has been done in the rental space. The rental space is officially done. Uh, at this point, we're just waiting for a tenant to occupy. And then we are happy chappies, you know? And then I can expect my rental each month and all of that. And that's something to look forward to, too. So that's pretty much it. That's where I'm going to leave this vlog. I am going to relax. I just got back from work about um, an hour ago. And I did some reading. And then I can feel now that I want to kind of relax and maybe even take an afternoon nap. It is very cold. Um, and uh, yeah, I really just want to relax. I've been putting out a lot of content since I've been back. And I'm happy about it, you know. No complaints on my end. Um, yeah. I'm glad to be back. I'm really happy. Um... And just because I'm a depressed person doesn't mean depressed people don't get happy too. So I'm in my happy phase. Uh, I do have days where I just kind of um, disappear a little bit into my head. Uh, but my pills help a lot with uh, keeping my mood quite stable. And um, yeah, just the injection of all those, um, you know, the serotonin and all of that, that just makes me puts me in a good space is really great for me because I haven't felt this good in a really long time. Um, so I'm capitalizing on it. Okay. I don't know how long this bit is going to be. I'm so sorry if it is too long, uh, but I'm not either. You guys know my vlogs are typically long, but I don't think this one will be that long. Aside from that, I am going to go. I am going to start recording for the next vlog tomorrow. Um, so I will see you in the next vlog the next vlog will have a um clothing haul because i have bought a number of clothes uh shortly before i went away and after i came back i got these oh these combat boots from steve madden what anyway and a couple of track suits because that's how i roll um yeah so you'll see those in the next vlog i might uh i'm gonna go so until the next vlog, I'll see you very, very soon, okay?